Seaweed stands for the Sandia Interactive Wave Energy Education Display. Basically, a giant fish tank that has a wave maker. Which is the, the part, the spade part, that actually makes the waves and simulates the environment and the ocean. And then the WEC part, uh, which is on another electronic space, also with Arduino controllers. Those two sections are brought together with the computer that the person interacts with. And that graphic interface is what controls different aspects of the wave maker. You can change things like the frequency and amplitude and all um, a bunch of other aspects. This actually works and this really represents what the scaled up system will be. And so you can mess with the parameters and see how they're gonna interact and you can physically feel it and you can see it. One of the big takeaways of this project is that it's the software behind the hardware that has a huge effect on the performance of that hardware. So by adjusting the parameters in our graphical unit user interface, people are able to see that the power output can be drastically changed just based on how well the device is tuned in the software. Well, the goal of the tank is to basically take it around and travel to different conferences, schools, and events to educate students and other engineers and STEM professionals about wave energy. Anything you can get in a student's hands that they can interact with that moves uh, is always very interesting and helps learning go along as opposed to looking at a textbook or a video. We have the WaveMaker running and the WEC running, but it's all a bit ugly and has a lot of cables exposed. So the next projects are uh, cleaning it up, getting it all looking nice, and then adding a beach portion that'll have a little miniature town on it. And so those lights will light up to kind of simulate that the WEC is producing power and lighting up the town. Yeah, this is a completely intern-led project. Um, it's, it's actually really liberating at Sandia to have, a, you know, come on as an intern and you expect to be getting people's coffees, but uh, instead they give you a project and tell you to do what you want with it. And uh, it's really liberating and great and uh, absolutely a great experience.